Hello gamers! Today we're diving into the Awakened Raids of Dragonflight Season 4, including a special focus on Awakened Vaults of Incarnates. In Dragonflight Season 4, instead of introducing new raids, players will revisit the three raids from the Dragonflight expansion. Vault of the Incarnates, Aberus, the Shadowed Crucible, and Amir Drassel, the Dream's Hope. These are now called Awakened Raids, similar to the Faded Raids from Shadowlands Season 4, offering a tougher challenge and superior loot, complete with a new raid affix to up the ante. Need assistance with the Awakened Vault Raid or any raid this season? Visit conquestcapped.com. Rated 5 stars on Trustpilot, they provide reliable boosting services. Their professional raiding team guarantee completion of raids without bans or account sharing, all within a few hours. Plus, use my promo code POISYT for a 10% discount, find the link in the video description. Previously in Shadowlands Season 4, faded raids were rotated on a weekly schedule. Each week, one of the raids would become faded, increasing its difficulty and the item level of drops from that specific raid for the week. Just like the faded raids, awakened raids rotate on a weekly schedule. Each week, a different Dragonflight raid becomes awakened, ramping up the difficulty and enhancing the loot quality. Because awakened raids are scaled higher in difficulty than all other Dragonflight raids, the item drops from awakened raids also have a higher item level, like the previous difficulties of each raid, the final boss of each raid drops items with increased item levels when compared to the rest of the raid. You heard it here first! Nashuro, the Unbound Legacy, and Firalath, the Dream Render, will receive upgrades to match the power level of Season 4. The introduction of a new upgrade item, the Scale of Awakening, allows players to elevate their legendary items to a starting item level of 502. Additionally, with the use of Crests and Flight Stones, these legendaries can be further enhanced beyond level 502. This upgrade ensures that your cherished legendaries remain valuable and effective in all Season 4 content. Completing all three Mythic Awakened Raid rewards you with teleports to Aberus, Amirdrassil, and Vault of the Incarnates. Completing all three Heroic Awakened Raids rewards you with Awakened Hero Title. Completing all three Normal Awakened Raids rewards you with Voyaging Wilderling Mount. Additionally, this season introduces the Awakened Tempo Stone, exchangeable for pieces of the Season 4 tier set armor. These tokens drop from the final bosses of each Awakened raid and are available to all players regardless of class or armor type. There's also a new currency system, the Antique Bronze Bullion, similar to the Puzzling Cartel Dinar from Shadowlands. This system offers a form of bad luck protection, giving players a guaranteed way to acquire sought-after weapons, gear, and trinkets. And remember, you can unlock all these fantastic rewards with a little help from the Conquest Cap team. Don't forget to check out the link in the description. Stay tuned for more updates on the thrilling developments in Dragonflight Season 4. See you in the next video. Bye!